Well, welcome, friends. What a great week we've had together. I truly hope you have valued your time here. Our theme this year was to see different and to think different, and we have delivered on that promise. I know you won't forget things, and I certainly won't forget many of the experiences I've had here this week. Just this morning, I was texted a message from one of you attendees about the new $9 million deal procurement that's gonna happen with a company here in Calgary. $9 million. Now, I think that might be worth a couple of days here, don't you? So that, the robots, the sessions, the speakers, fabulous. Our attendance continues to grow, with 4,000 of you joining us here in person in Calgary. We're proud to continue growing this important event here in our, one of Alberta's largest cities. For the thousands who have joined us from limited sessions online through the Unbound platform, we are pleased to host that venue to improve access for the few people that are unable to be here. Many of you come here as perhaps old friends, and now we leave as new partners. At Alberta Innovates, we live our five C's, as we call them. Curiosity, collaboration, commitment, can-do spirit, and creativity. Inventures personifies these values, and I would like to add a few more C's of my own. The conference is about the connections we make, the collisions we experience, and I want to challenge you as well. Do not let this be the end of those conversations. At the start of Inventures, I talked about how much innovation is about being alive to the unexpected and discovering new tools to take on some of our toughest challenges. There has been no shortage of information available. Over the last three days, we've hosted over 150 sessions with more than 500 speakers. Some of these were standing room only, and our panelists were superb, sharing some of the newest ideas available. We're literally able to see into the future through these panels. Through them, we get to see what's possible. And through the pitch competitions, we've seen the next generation of businesses, and perhaps you've just seen some of the new unicorns that will be coming that sit amongst us today. I again want to congratulate the winners that we just saw here on stage, and I can't wait to see the success that lies ahead of you and where you will go. I've learned many things over my career, but an important message that's worth repeating is that we can't get to where we want to be going it on our own. Too often we build transactional relationships, and once the transaction is over, then the relationship fades. We need to create lasting relationships where we can work together on multiple ventures with trusted partners. I hope that this week you were able to start on what will be a long-term dur durable relationships. Those are what will make our technology and innovation ecosystem really thrive. We can't afford to leave opportunities on the table, and the people in this room know better than anyone that opportunities don't create themselves. We, we must make that future happen. The past few days have been the first journey in that, the first steps in that journey, and I hope that journey will also lead you to many others back to this conference again next year. I want to thank you for coming, and I want to sincerely thank our hosts here at the Tellers Convention Center for a great venue. But I also want to thank many people at Alberta Innovates and our partners and sponsors who have spent hundreds of hours getting this event organized and pulling together such amazing speakers. But I have to make an exception to the many I'm thanking. I especially want to thank Chris Valentine, Michelle Murdo, and Shannon Gordon, and I'm gonna ask them to join me on stage.
This is Team Adio, our event producers. From the start of InVentures, they have made this work for us. Please join me in thanking one of the best production teams in the world. They only produce world-class productions, and I think you've experienced it here today. Please join me in thanking them so much. Thank you. In just a moment, you're going to be the first people to see what InVentures 2024 will look like. Yes, we're already planning it for your return next year. There's going to be a special offer available for those of you who've been here as part of that exclusive look. Now, once this is done, just wait a little bit, then you're gonna get out there, you're gonna go in and innovate for me, you're gonna spark something new, you are going to have a wonderful rest of the day, the weekend, and the year. And when we meet next year, I can't wait to hear what you've done. Have a safe journey home, but just before you go, one last treat. Thank you. Wow, what an incredible last three days it's been. InVentures would not be possible without the support of our amazing sponsors and our partners. So we'd like to give a special thanks to Alberta Innovates, as well as our title sponsor, ATB Financial, and of course, our media sponsor, Global News. As well, we would like to thank our exceptional ASL interpreters, our performers, our speakers, our panelists, yes! our production crew, our volunteers, and all those who make InVenture such a momentous event every single year. Now, it has been a tremendous pleasure for me to serve as your MC, as your shepherd along this InVenture's journey. The experience has certainly widened my perspective and impacted me in the best of ways. I am honored to be a part of this game-changing community and so grateful for all the inspirational people that I have gotten the chance to meet. So thank you for allowing me to be your main stage guide throughout this entire time. And thank you for giving me an opportunity to get out of the house and wear my best outfits. <laughs>
2023 edition of Inventures, it is time for me to pass on the MC torch to our next one. You know him, you love him, our roving reporter, Graham Neal, as our 2024 MC. All right. Come on, guys. Come on out. Let's keep it going. Give me some music, everybody. Come on. There we go. Everybody have a good time in 2023. Come on, let's hear everybody in 2023. Forget about 2023. It's over. It's so 2023. Let's talk about 2024. It's going to be bigger, better than ever. Michio left half of his quantum computer backstage. I put it together. Predictions say more people, more speakers, more fun. So you want to get your tickets right now. Yeah, you want to get your tickets right now. Here's a secret hiding right in front of you on the back of your badge. Who has ever turned and looked at the back of their badge? Be doing now. Nobody. What's on there? A deal. $2.99 early bird conference special. It's probably cheap because I'm hosting. So basically what you want to do is get these uh, tickets before they sell out. Do you want to go to your boss and expense the full price? I don't know. Did I tell you to do that? Not really. But what you want to do Get your tickets. We don't know how long the early bird's gonna be on. We saw the lineup's gonna get in. It's gonna be packed next year. So please, I wanna see you all here in 2024. Lila has lent me her entire wardrobe to wear. The whole yellow, the whole whatever it is. Lila's gonna be back. You'll see her around. I'm looking forward to it. We're gonna, I wanted to introduce some speakers. They won't let me because it's only coming up on the website. Go to the website, $2.99. Get them now, don't be disappointed. Who's coming back next year? Let's hear you. Uh, all right, we'll see you back here next year. Have a great time, everybody. Drive safe, 2024.